All right, this is called Legend. And what this does is explain to you the geographics of the mountain that you are about to go down. As you can see, we've got different points. You've yeah. got your blue diamonds, you've got your black diamonds, you've got your different runs. You've always, of course, have your Red Cross, your mountain patrol, always there to watch out when you fall down. The mountain offers an incredible variety of things that you can do depending on your skill level. Now, the same thing applies in the house of God. The same thing applies in the kingdom of God. As you look at it, everybody automatically wants to go to the top and say, I can do this. God's called me to be at the top. I've been told I'm called. I've been told I have a great gift. But what you don't understand, God never starts you at the top. He starts you right down here at the bottom where it says Learning Center, right next to Coyote Flats. It's all green, a little bit of a grade. Why? To prove that you have what it takes to make it to the top of the mountain. Because it's okay to fall if you're down in the learning area, but you don't want to fall from the top. Remember, pride comes before a fall. And the bigger you are, the harder you fall all the time. Now, one of the principles to remember as you get involved in anything in life, whether it be sports, whether it be serving God, there's always levels of expertise that you need to know exactly which one of these you belong at. Here we've got the beginner lessons. These are people which I consider to be in Chris's class of people. They don't even know the fundamentals. They don't know why a strap is important. They don't understand why their edge is so important. And if they fall, uh, the beginner instruction level shows them how to do it correctly. You then go to intermediate lessons. Intermediate would be somebody, say maybe one of my sons, who's just begun to snowboard last season. He wants to go to an even greater level of proficiency. He can't get to intermediate until he goes to beginners. We then go to advanced lessons. This is where you've taken everything that you've learned in beginners and intermediate, you then bring it to the advanced proficiency. This is when your coach begins to say, you know what, you're ready to do this on your own, give it a shot. There's no way you can do advanced if you haven't mastered the first two. Then you get down to somebody like Jake. And this is where you have gotten so good at your skill, you've honed it, You've sharpened it over years, over falls, you've messed up, you've wiped out, you've been humbled. Only then can you get to the place to where people say, you know what, that dude rides freestyle. What does that mean? He knows how his body reacts. He knows what to do and what not to do. So it's easy to put him in 10 feet of powder. It's easy to let him go on the side of a mountain. Why? Because he knows exactly what to do. Not only to enjoy himself, but to come off of the mountain in one piece.